Today I'm gonna to show you how to put in a set of parallels. These parallels are 1.625 high. They're gonna go into our standard jaws, which is 1.75. This is gonna give us 0.125 clamping area. We're gonna take these, make sure the bottom is clean, slide them in. Notice how they're loose. We have to go in and apply pressure to the inside so that way when we're milling, they don't come loose. You can hold your parallels a couple different ways. You can use band material, you can use snap-in parallels that go in your jaws. Or you also have a spring clamp. This is gonna apply pressure to the inside of both the parallels and keep them from moving. Whenever you put it in, you always wanna relax both sides so that way the parallels fall down and they don't stick up at a weird angle or height. If one little chip gets underneath that parallel, you're gonna start scrapping parts. Now that we have our parallels in, we're gonna take our material and we're gonna also double check that the setup sheet is correct with what we're setting up. The distance between the top of this and our parallel is 0.125, which is the correct amount that we need to hold off in terms of cutting our part. Once we have our material filed down, so that way there's no burrs, we're gonna go ahead and put it in. That's how you put in parallels.